Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm going to help you fix the YouTube error 400. There is a problem with your network. It's pretty quick and easy. So let's jump right in. Now, if you're getting a message that looks like this, there's a problem with your network or server, and it gives you the error 400 code. There are a few different things that we can do to get it fixed and get you able to use YouTube again. The very first thing that I would recommend is open up our settings here and then we will scroll down until we get to general and tap on general and then iPhone storage. Now, once this loads up, we're going to find the YouTube app. It's right here and we're going to offload and then reinstall the app. So what this does is it refreshes all of the core system files within that YouTube app itself. And a lot of times clears up lots of glitches or errors like the error 400 code that you see there. So once this is done loading up, we can open up the YouTube app and make sure that it is working, that we are not getting that error 400 code anymore. If you're still getting it, then let's open up Safari or Google Chrome and let's just do a quick speed test. So type in speed test here and hit run speed test and make sure that this is fast enough to load up any kind of videos or watch videos on YouTube faster than say five megabytes per second is perfect. So if it's not fast enough, what we can do is we can swipe down from the top right and we can always toggle off the Wi-Fi to switch over to cell data, which might be a bit faster depending on where you are and your internet connection on your Wi-Fi. So once you go through those steps, hopefully the YouTube app will be working. The last step that you can do if it's still not working is let's go back into Safari or Google Chrome and let's just type in is YouTube down. And down detector is a great option here. Let's go there and we'll go and see if there's an all of a sudden a huge spike in reports that YouTube is down. That might give us a good indication that it might be not your specific app itself or your phone itself, but YouTube is having an issue that's giving you that error 400 code. I hope this helps. Thanks for your time today and I'll see you on the next one.